you hear that? Hmm? Nothing. And the best part is, the lightsabers actually shoot up when you put hot water in. <laughs> That's a shit mark, Eddie. What the hell? Did you just say something? Wait, I swear I'm going mad, you know. I'm actually going mad. <sighs> Review Venom. I don't understand! Who are you? What do you want from me? I don't get it! Eddie... Huh? Eddie, I was gonna... Welcome to Agents of Screen, the first and only place to come to for movie reviews live at the cinema. We've just watched Venom and do you know what? Let's get straight into initial reactions. How did everyone feel? I just want to say <laughs> round of applause to Sony. You just <laughs> f***ed it all up. <laughs> you guys are trash. Never touch another Marvel film again. Wow. Please. They need to just stop. Okay. Sony needs to go back to making stereos. <laughs> I'll say first reactions. That is probably the worst film I've seen this year. Yeah, you by far. Slender Man. Yeah, 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 I haven't seen that. But well, this is by far the worst film this year. I think Tom Hardy's acting was appalling. And I honestly thought, knowing his calibre, I honestly expected more from him because of like, and everyone else was saying, oh yeah, man, this movie won't be bad. Tom Hardy's in it. Yeah, yeah, it's, that's, that's what people say. Yeah. People were saying, oh, if the movie's bad, at least we got Tom Hardy. Yeah, and, and this guy seems like he wants to go. And that's fine. <laughs> that's oh, fine. Exactly. Aaron, what? Wow! First of all, so I need to take back them applause that I was with, I was with you because I thought you were going to say something good, so I've got to take that back. Wait, you said you applauded with me? Yeah, you. I <laughs> thought man was going to say something. But yeah, I don't agree with that at all. Personally, I think the film was better than I expected. I'm not saying it's an, it was an amazing film, but I thought the film was going to be trash. But it wasn't. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. 100% not the worst film I've seen or you've seen this year. It's not. 100%, I'm telling you that. I'm telling you. I don't think the film was anywhere near as bad as you two said. I just don't, I just don't think it was. And I and I didn't have any high, I didn't have any expectations for it to be good at all. Miles, I haven't really heard much from you yet. What was just your to, just to address one of the points about Eddie Brock? I think with Tom Hardy, he was trying to portray like an unhinged character, and I think he, for the most part, he done that. But that being said, though, <laughs> not to quote Drake, but I'm upset. This why, why are you upset? Because this this Venom movie was a, a disrespect. I'm so so offended that you know I had to double check. You no, know? so only made it. So what did we expect? Boss. And I wasn't impressed. Second. What do you think? What did I think? Yeah, what did you feel? My first impression, I went in blank as well. I didn't see any trailers. I had no expectation. I didn't know who, I didn't even know who the villain was going to be. And uh, yeah, I mean, I, there were some pretty cool scenes. I felt like it had a bit of a darkness feel. You know, the game, the darkness. The, the early parts of the film, when he first starts using his powers, it really had a real darkness feel to it. Other than that, though, I, I, I'm not, I don't hate it as much as certain people are going on. I didn't, obviously, I didn't love it. I just was kind of like, I watched it, I was like, yeah, it was all right. I have to say that the CGI in this film was really, really bad. It was poor in certain areas. That motorbike scene, Jesus. Did you did you see did you see the um, the stunt man, the stunt double? And there's a point the where yeah, yeah, on the pavement. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> For a good five yeah. seconds, you can tell it's not Tom Hardy. And then there's a bit where I think it was that same move around the post. They go back onto Tom Hardy's face. It's not Tom Hardy. It is the stunt well, double. How they get away with that? I, you telling me? I can see you. I can, it's, it's not Tom. I can see you. All right, well, I mean, look, aside from Aaron, everyone says some pretty bad things about the film. I mean, if you had to give some, point out some pretty good scenes about the film, has anyone else got any? Not even scenes. For me, personally, again, don't hate me. The, for me, um, the build up when he first started experiencing the madness, the music, I thought the music was sick. Like it was proper, like horror, kind of sinister. I thought that was mad. But I personally think the 
the first half of the film was the better half of the film for me personally before he fully became Venom and I thought that whole sequence was really good. I'm saying, but the actual beginning, the whole bit where he's all like interviewing people. Oh, this is Eddie Brock report. I don't care. I know, but I hear that, but it was, there's a better way of doing it. And I've just thought it was tiring, but yeah. Sorry, in terms of things I liked about the, the film, there was one specific scene when he was trying to escape from the life foundation. I think he was trying to jump out the window and then he was like, no. Yeah, 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 and then Venom said to him, pussy. <laughs> that was quite funny, I thought. Yeah. But this is the thing, this is why I like, I, I like the comedy in this film. Like, yeah. I, I, yeah, I think good. it was quite funny. I was afraid that they were gonna just try and, as usual, let's just copy Dark Knight, try and be as dark as possible. And, so I'm actually glad they put a lot of comedic moments. That's the funny bit was, uh, the bathroom scene where he fell oh, yeah. down. That was, like, and that was my first laugh. That, yeah, yeah. that was really funny. Those, those two bits in those are the yeah, best yeah, two sick. bits. That those are sick. my two favorite bits of the film. What did Otherwise, you say that is like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, and that a lot of hit and misses for me. Well, okay. Well, how did people feel about that? Because when we first got our real interaction with Venom, when he came out of him, looked at him, and said, "Right, I love that my goal is to take over this world, and I'm just going to destroy you," lot, and yeah. If you're lucky, I might not kill you. I mean, the transition to him going, oh, do you know what, I want to save this world. I mean, was that too fast? I, I tell you, no, no, i tell you why it wasn't. They I went through a lot, man. I'll tell you why it wasn't, because he, when he gets into you, he, he understands you, he gets to know you yeah, and shit like that, yeah. Right, and then even when he linked with the girl, which yeah. I thought that was also a good bit, and even that her voice a, sounds a, sick a, as well. That, that, that was an Easter egg. Well, she Venom, I think. Is yeah. it? It's exactly that. the same as well. Yeah. Oh, no, she looked good though. <laughs> but then like um, the bit where he, she, he goes into her, and then he goes back into her, he goes, oh no, I, I, you know, I like her, she's really cool. I, I, I get why he would like Eddie, because he gets into your brain and stuff like that, and lo lo yeah. gets to know you sort of thing. Okay, yeah, fair enough. I mean, personally, I just thought it, he went from one stage, like, I'm looking to take over this world. Yeah, yeah. But then I guess he had his reasons. He said, you know what, I'm a loser on yeah, my planet. Like, like, you, yeah. You're a loser as well, I'm a loser, but if I'm here, Kind of like Superman. Uh, over on Crypto, he's just nothing, isn't he? And he comes to Earth and he's a flipping so god. Terrible comparison. I know he has a baby. Yeah, what? Yeah. So uh, he has a baby, what? He was something? He was nothing. Uh, now, let's get into the video. Every time we do a film, maybe a superhero film, we always do a little mini review about the villain. Now, how did everyone feel about the villain this time around? What do we think? I liked the, the, the Drake guy. I thought he was a proper prick. Like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He, he, he played that role. He sold his character. Well, like, and he was, when he was talking to um, Dora, and he was like, oh, yeah, do human trials. Think about what you're going to be doing for whatever, whatever. Yeah. Oh, yeah, how's your kids? And it, but he Please, just, he just manipulative. didn't even bat an eyelid. It was just even bam, bam. the first human trial that they had, Isaac, he was all telling him a biblical yeah, story. story yeah. Gassing him up. He said, like, Abraham's not the most important. Like, Gassing Isaac is the hero of the story. Like, you can He's be the clever, sacrifice. I will that, not let you down. Yeah, I will yeah. not let you down. Touch his hand, all of that. And Gassing. then he was like, yeah. Release the release him. <laughs> he, yeah. he was a good villain. Yeah, he, he, sell, he can sell bread to a baker. Yeah, sell yeah, a fence yeah. to his next door neighbor. <laughs> yeah, yeah. To be fair though, that is one of his. That is actually one of Venom's enemies as well. Though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Appearance-wise, do you think he looked a bit too similar? I think they looked a bit too similar to be fair. Yeah. What parts? But I think they. He he's he is grey and he's got like a like yeah, red, yeah, yeah, red yeah. streak. That's but why I'm imagine... looking forward to the next one. Yeah. Because you will tell the difference. Yeah, I, I would say with Raya, I don't think he had enough screen time for me to care enough about him. His character wasn't fleshed out enough. And as you said, like I think they look similar. I could tell the difference, but I think it's a bit too... I hate when they have like a, a hero and a villain and they look quite similar. And they, when they're like tussling, you can hardly tell the difference. Even in Black Panther with Killmonger and thing, like it was a very slight difference. So. I hate when they do stuff like that. Speaking of that last scene when they were fighting, uh, is it just me or is that pretty sick when the symbiotes were fighting and as they leaned out, the humans were in there and I couldn't really tell, were they also fighting or were they no, just no, like, uh... No, no, you have seen that before. They do that in the comics. When they're fighting, they're, those two, maybe two or three bits where they like the symbiotes were kind of coming off and they were there. They've got those scenes like yeah, in the yeah, comics yeah. and they've kind of taken is there anything else anyone wanted to say? Anything they liked, didn't like? I thought the film could have been more dark. I think it could have been more dark. I was looking for like a rated R, like Venom. I think that was the original no plan, wasn't yeah, it? That, I thought the, the, the head was showing more like, uh, I think that was a bit weird though, is when at the end, which was a bit dumb, when he, when, when, when um, he went into the store again, 
um, to oh, yeah, buy yeah, some yeah. like food yeah. or whatever it was. I mean, as soon as he walked into the store, we kind of everyone yeah. knew yeah. what. But was it's about just that. weird that like he walked in and the guy came in for his money on that exact day. Well, it's not. It's not a big deal. My only okay. issue that it's part, a comic book movie. You know? Yeah, well, yeah, but that part was weird because he ate him. But there was no blood or no like yeah, it was just clean. yeah it was just clean. Not, well, I was looking for that when he <laughs> walked it? out. I was like I was like where is it? Where's the where's the where's the, where's no, the body? He cleaned that guy. I think like the, the store owner didn't seem that shocked. Like she was like, "What's that, Eddie?" Yeah, she goes, "Oh, Eddie, what was that?" Like, yeah, she's been getting hustled. Like, like it was a new hat he was wearing. What's that? She's, she's been getting hustled and threatened for years. Is isn't that it? that wow. new? Is that that new? T- you got those exclusives, like yeah. <laughs> me, so I might as well just roll with it, innit? It's probably like, oh yeah, that's all. Cool. <laughs> I might as well just roll with it. <laughs> <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't rolling with it. Well, before we move on to the scores, we know that this is the first film in a Venomverse or whatever they want to call it. Sony's first of three. So. After the credits, we saw something which I think was very, very special. Now, you lot didn't like Venom, yeah? You lot hated Venom, yeah? Apart from Aaron. The next one, with Carnage. Don't really know if you can do that. If you get a character who's flipping insane. And fair. Do you know how dark Carnage is? Yeah. They don't put, if they don't get it right, it is going to be a bad film again, and that's a problem. Is it going to need to be an 18? If it's to be a an PG-13, just forget. I don't care how good... Woody Harrison, sick guy, yeah, sick actor. I don't care how sick he does in that film. If it's a PG-13, Carnage is going to be... It's going to be Chris, yeah. just it's Christmas. Yeah. 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 The problem is, it's not, we all know right now, yeah, we ain't got a problem, problem with him doing it. Yeah. It's not, that's not the problem. Is Sony going to execute this film the way we want it to be? Kind of summarise how we feel about this film. Let's get into the actual scores. We're going to start with... <laughs> a four. And that's it. I'm, I'm done. I'm, I, there's nothing more to say. It's a four. I'm, I think I'm even being generous on that. A four. I'm just. I'm. I'm being truthful to myself. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, <laughs> Miles. I want to give Venom. I'd give it a five point five. We discussed all the reasons already. I think I was just. I know what this movie could be. I think we say that so often. But I'll never watch this film again. Never. You'll never watch it again. When number two comes out, you don't recap. I'm not interested, like, I'm not really interested. I don't know what they would have to do to get me back. Maybe Carnage, but that, that's not enough in itself. Yeah, 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 fair enough. Ben. Mirroring what everyone has said, it's not a bad film, but it's not a sick film. I feel like the pacing was off of points where I felt, is this a finale? Is this it? And, but there was aspect, aspects I did like. For instance, he was conflicted in himself at points. It was like a Jack and Hyde. Like, you know where it's like, it's a good, like, yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah like. So. Well done, man, that was a good comparison. Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so, I like, like, the action scenes, I thought they were fun. They weren't brilliant, but they were fun. So, I think I'll give this a six. A six? Uh, hmm, Aaron. The film was not trash. The film was not spectacular, but it was an enjoyable film. It was an enjoyable film, man. I think I need to give this film a 6.5. I think I'll give it a 6.5. I don't, I don't want to compare scores enough. You know, you gave De- De- uh, Deadpool 2 6.5. Yeah. So, so, no, 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 look, 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 because no, no, it resonates, that, that number still resonates. So I'm assuming these films are on par. 6.5 is a good film. But you just said 6.5. So, so that's a good film. Yes, I said yeah, I, I agree. Say that oh, no, so, so I'm saying, are we say Deadpool 2 and Venom it's a good film. Are, are like... It's a good film. It doesn't mean they're the same. Doesn't oh. mean they're, doesn't mean they're the same. All right, fine, okay. Different films. I yeah. can go now, cool. Yeah, um, okay. <laughs> you have to get it off your chest. Cool, cool. Yeah. No, to be fair, I'll be honest, as we're discussing it now, when we watch this film, my score went up slightly. Like Miles said, there were some really good bits where I would probably go on YouTube and go, oh, I will watch that bits because those bits were pretty cool. But I don't think I'd ever watch this film throughout. In its entirety. Not possible, no. With that said, my score was going to be a 3.5. That's what <laughs> that it was going to be. And I still, I still, I still stand by that. Like it's the, the worst film this year for me. 100%, right? Wait, you've seen The Meg. Uh, yeah. The, the Meg's better. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I actually enjoyed The Meg. <laughs> so anyway, so anyway. <laughs> Over this, over this, 100%. And with that said, my score is 4.5. I, I, again, I like the dynamic between the um, Eddie and, and Venom. I think that was cool. 
The movie had a very slow start, but had, you know, caught itself up over time. Um, the action scenes were here and there. They were, they were decent. But as far as I'm concerned, that's a 4.5. And I'm being nice. Okay. And I probably hate it more shake, than him. I'll, I'll shake your hand yeah? that. I, I probably hate it more than he did. Do you know what? As I said earlier, you know, to repeat what I said, I didn't hate the film. I don't think it was bad enough how you lot are going on. I think you lot are overreacting, man. This film is nowhere near as bad as you lot are saying. Like, would you watch it again? Would I watch it again? Yeah. No? Alright, there you go then. But no, I... <laughs> no, 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 I know you just gave your score, but this is, this is Venom. Look how long we've waited for this, bro. Look how long we've waited for this. This is what they gave us. It's supposed to be like genre changing. This Venom is not like some any guy. This yeah, is yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, I, I, listen, listen, listen. With that in mind, with that in mind, <laughs> I, un I understand all that. I understand all that. That's why I went in blank and I give it a 6.5. Right, I think we've pretty much covered everything. That's been our review and discussion for Venom. Did you agree with what the man they had to say? Did you disagree? Let us know, leave a comment. If you're new to the channel, subscribe, like, share, everything, do all of that stuff. Social media, we're on Instagram, we're on Twitter, we're on YouTube, which is what you're watching it on now. I've been your boy, Eddard. That's been Agents of Screen, and we'll catch you in the next video. Mantra.